Okay, ISRO has made India proud once again. As always, their most powerful and the heaviest rocket, GSLV Mark III D1, blasted off from Sri Harikota Space Center in Andhra Pradesh. A historic evening and yet another major step towards being self-reliant in the country's space program. Five, four, three, two, one, zero. For the hundred odd engineers and scientists of Indian Space Research Organization, this was the moment they were waiting for. Wow. Seconds into the, flight. Last 20 seconds. the picture perfect launch of India's heaviest rocket, the GSLV Mark III D1. Last 30 seconds. As a 640-ton rocket hurtled into space at 5.28 p.m. from Sri Harikota, it was the result of more than two decades of research. Yet another big space leap for India as it entered the league of major powers with the launch of the Fat Boy satellite. Plus 50 seconds. India's homegrown monster rocket, the geosynchronous satellite launch vehicle Mark III blasted off with a 3136 kg communication satellite, GSAT-19, the heaviest rocket to be launched into space till date. I take this. Here are some astonishing facts about the fat boy. The GSLV Mark III was developed over a span of 15 years at a cost of around 400 crores. It's a three-stage vehicle built to carry heavier satellites. GSLV Mark III could be the first satellite to ferry people into the space. It will help data transfer using multiple frequency beam. More than 25 years of hard work plus 11 or more flight tests and finally the ISRO scientists have a success story to talk about GSLV Mark III and its launch. Now this means that our Indian scientists are no longer dependent on foreign countries to launch their satellite vehicles and moreover now they can also pressurize the central government to release the 12,500 crore rupees for the man-made mission project that they have envisioned seven years from now. From Chennai, this is Akshana for Internet.